Hey, what's up, everybody? Week six recap here. Um, <laughs> I almost don't want to do this this week. Uh, not looking good for my team. Let's check last week's recap real quick. This one's going to be short because uh, no point wasting your time. With the BS, uh, week five, my matchup, I lost to Road Kings. He had 87.98 points. I had 84.82 uh, top players was Andre Ellington and Phillip Rivers. He had Andrew Luck and the Carolina Panthers defense. Um, let's pull up this, the match up there. Try to head back a week. And there you go. Shows Road King as a winner. Uh, Phillip Rivers had a big day for me. Calvin Johnson, I don't know what happened there. Uh, pretty much nothing. Uh, Alshon Jeffrey, not not bad. This is kind of where he should be. Uh, Steve Smith, not great. Look at that, 1.4. We could do without that. Andre Ellington killed it, 26 points. Uh, Darren Sproles didn't do much. Delaney Walker didn't do much. Novak did okay. And my Arizona defense choked it. But we played Denver, so it was kind of expected. Uh, if I would add Tampa Bay in, I would add 8 points compared to 7 or 1 for that. Uh, if I would have Russell Wilson in instead of Phillip Rivers, I would have had a couple more points there. He had 34 points. Um, and that would definitely would have brought me up over there. You see, I would have had uh, a lot more than 84 points. I would have surpassed him if I would have made the right couple of moves here. And it just didn't happen. And what are you going to do? Hindsight is 2020. Um, 0 and 5 right now. Not looking good. Not much. Uh, Fantasy football season isn't that long, and it's not a whole season worth. It cuts you short by at least a few weeks, so there's not much time left to get points and wins, and I'm definitely behind the curve here. Uh, biggest blowout was Exulus uh, versus Not All Blacks, uh, a.k.a. Tony versus Tyler. Huge game for uh, Tony, 135 points. Uh, Tyler had 67. Uh, that's a spread of 68 points, big one there. That's going. That's going to be hard to beat for uh, biggest blowout blowout of the season. <clears throat> As you know, I lost. Of course, Road King. Uh, Tony beat Tyler. Uh, I got Pooh. Um, <laughs> beat All Blacks. Uh, Short Bus beat Jersey Reapers. Grim Logic beat These Nuts. These Nuts in first place right now. Looks like it's Grim Logic. Record of four and one. Uh, second place, these nuts. Third place, same record. Uh, not all blacks. Fourth place, Jersey Reapers. Same record. Uh, short bus. Let's see. Wait. Fourth place was Jersey, right? Okay. I got poo. Everybody's at three and two. Even though they have your different listings, you guys all pretty much have the same record, so we can send you tied for that place. I'm saying. And there's me at zero and five, way at the bottom. I got some issues here. I don't understand. Because as you see, I have some people who are producing, just not enough going on here. Uh, so I think I'll make a couple moves. Let's just check our matchup real quick. See what kind of moves we can make. As it stands right now, I'm playing against I Got Poo on me. He's picked to win. 65% uh, favorite. He has 94 or 95 projected points against my 82. And let's see why. Uh, Calvin Johnson. We got an issue here. Is he injured? Uh, said he strongly considered holding Calvin Johnson out for week six. So, bam, there's a move we can make right there. Let's go ahead and just put him on the burner or the back burner. Uh, give somebody else a chance if we have another receiver to take a spot. And guess what? We got John Brown. So. John Brown didn't really get anything done last week. Uh, we played against Denver, and he just – our offense wasn't doing much at all. Um, so that's why he didn't get any points last week. But he might have a better chance this week. We'll see how that works out. Something to review in the next video. Uh, he's scheduled to get – or predicted to get 7.5, so that will be better than uh, Calvin Johnson's potential zero. And that, that bumps it up to 89 points. Uh, a little less of a favorite now. At 50, uh, 56%. <clears throat> Check our bench players. See if there's anybody projected to have a bigger day. Russell Wilson's playing against Dallas. 18 points projection. 
Uh, Philip Rivers versus Oakland projected to get 17. I'm guessing that uh, Philip Rivers is going to get a lot more than 17 points from playing against the Raiders, so we're going to leave that. Blaney Walker, probable. Um, problem or uh, quarterback? Titans have quarterback problems. Mid range to low end, tight end one when Tennessee meets Jacksonville. So they're playing Jacksonville. That's going to be. Um, wait. Yeah, they're playing Jacksonville. So we're going to leave him in 7.85 points. Uh, there's a pretty good chance he's going to get that. Darren Sproul's playing with Philadelphia. They're playing against New York. Uh, who else can we put in? Amal Bradshaw against Houston. Houston's looking good defensively. Um, but he's scheduled to have more points, so we're gonna we're gonna just pop him in for the sake of trying to get as much points as we can at this point. So go ahead and sit um old Darren Sproles there and bring in a mod. He's scheduled to get a couple more points. Hopefully that'll help us a little bit here. Check our matchup again. So brought a little bit closer there. If you see, uh, it's 46 to 54. Bumped me up to 92 points. Three points down for my guy Pooh. He's picked it to win. Um, you know, I'm, I'm going to let it ride here. I think we got a couple of good ones in there. And we'll see. I'll probably be surprised. Probably be surprised. I have been every week at this point. Um, that's just the way it goes. <laughs> um, any messages? Anything we got to share with anybody? Let's check that out real quick. I'm trying to cut down on the BS and the rambling and and uh, just keep it quick for the sake of doing it. We'll check the players list, see if anybody's available, what we can pick up. And even though it's still late, it's still Tuesday, I mean, it's not late enough for these people to be showing up as a free agent. If I do pick anybody up, I will be leaving that in the next video. Um, yep. So I think I'm going to leave it at that. Everybody uh, is doing pretty well. I really don't have anything to add because I am losing my tail right now. So I will keep it short. So I thank everybody for watching. If you get a chance, stop by my SoundCloud and my YouTube, uh, other videos. Check my music. Give that a like and a share if you don't mind. All right, guys. Uh, till the wheels fall off. TDMC. Peace. <coughs> okay, a little, uh, little add-on here before I... I thought I was done, but I was checking my other team here because I have another team, my original team that I started last year, and uh, it's a little bit different. Um, I'm getting a three, and I'm at three and two here. I just wanted to show you this, though. Okay, guys. Just so nobody feels bad about getting blown out. If that is that big enough for everybody, this is how much <laughs> I lost by it in this league last week. Look at that, 76 points. So uh, for the guy that I pointed out. Uh, Tyler, your loss um, being huge, this is bigger. So I just wanted to point out that. All right, and that was uh, my other league that I'm playing with. <laughs> All right, man, that's it. The uh, TDMC for life. God damn it. That's horrible, right? All right, peace out.